positions and ends up here a lot, but I know sometimes guys will be leaning into me, you know, and I know some people are flat on their face, you know, when you're doing stuff, but this is a good one to show some of these uh, moves from. So, I got my harness grip. I'm gonna go over just the basic attacks a little bit and then we'll kind of go from there. So, in D, I want this grip. This is like, a, like, like starting, I don't know, checkmate or whatever. This is what you want. You want this the whole time in E. If you get this, if you told me, hey man, you can start here, I'd be like, okay. I don't care who you are. Not that I'm the best in the world, but you set a white belt on my back and tell him to get this grip under my chin, he's gonna catch me in a choke, okay? So first off, get that. So let's go over the basic ones if I get this, all right? A, a little pointer on getting this, he's gonna tuck his chin. He's not retarded, okay? All right? He's gonna tuck his chin. What I've been good at doing is I'll take like this part of my hand here, and this is like a skinny bladed part of your hand. This is actually, and I'm just gonna, at an angle, I'm trying to wedge this into his hand. Chin. You see what I'm saying? It doesn't feel good, but it's tournament. This is a way to get under his chin. So I'm here. I'm just trying to get under his chin. Now I got it, and I'm pulling this. I'm kind of under. I'm pulling this. Now I'm under. I know this looks mean, but this is how you force the collar grip. All right. So now I've got it. You've got a couple basic chokes. Pull this down. Grip. Pull. Pull over. When you do this. You're not leaning, I call it a shoulder pillow, my shoulder's in his head so that he doesn't lean back to release the pressure. Guys do this, okay? And then they'll sink down. I like sink down. Yeah, they'll do this, all right? This is a counter, all right? So I need to do grip, shoulder pillow, and I'll just go choke. If I got this grip, my second option is he's fighting my hands. Fight, fight my hands. Swipe my hands, swipe my hands. I go foot on the hip. I switch to bow and arrow. Okay. Couple pointers on bow and arrow. It, it doesn't matter what I'm trying to grab my hair. <laughs> it doesn't matter what I'm grabbing. Preferably, I grab his leg, but, but past that, it doesn't matter. I got this grip. He fights my hand. I could do this. That's that's a bow and arrow still. I can grab his pants, I can grab his pants up here, I can hold his belt. I just don't want him to turn this way when I'm choking. That's, all, that's the only point of this move, okay? Um, but guys, you got this grip. Boom, for example, I did this, I did this, and he's, it's working. You're not strong enough. He's breaking your grip. You, there's a couple things you can do to make this stronger. One, scoot out one, stick your knee in his head, and he'll tap off of this. Okay? That's mean. Guys that are flexible, another option is this. I'm here. I'm trying. I'm trying this. It doesn't work. Take your foot. Make sure you're holding. These are ways to make it. So, we're going to go over Let me go over real quick slow. When everybody drilled, these are just... My opinion, when you're talking about the gi, your gi basic, 